so I, I just have um, a concern, and, I, and this is a little out of the realm of what we normally do, so I'll, I'll say that as I'm starting. But after listening to all these students' painful comments at the podium and what Mr. Adams said, I guess I feel, and I don't, I don't represent that area, I don't live in that area, but that picture that Mr. Adams showed us the fact that those trees have not been cut since last Thursday just is mind boggling to me. The fact that people are holding their breath as they're making turns is not acceptable. And I know you know that. I'm asking the board, what can we do to make sure that Lynn gets a message to her people from VDOT those trees need to be cut tomorrow. Tomorrow. Let's let's get back to the board here. Hold on just one second. Uh, go ahead, Ms. Monk. That's all I have to say. In my mind, Friday isn't acceptable. Thursday isn't acceptable. This has to happen now. I don't disagree with you, Ms. Bompey, but I think we have to look at reality. Reality is we've got this situation in a lot of different places in this county. And one of the main reasons we have it is because we had so much rain last year. I had to have a tree company come into my yard last Friday and cut the limbs because they'd grown so fast and so long, I couldn't see out of my driveway. I know it's, and, and maybe we ought to consider closing that landing until this is done. I don't have a problem with that. I don't know if other board members would have a problem with that or not. But if it is that bad, if, if people have to hold their breath coming out of there, um, I would ask the county administrator if the rest of the board agrees that we close this spot until this work is done. Is that acceptable to everyone? Mr. Stone, Mr. Cavalier? since we're kind of out of order now anyhow, yes. uh, first of all, I, I would like to pass along my condolences um, to Helen Wang's family and friends, many of you here today, and you know, I'm not in charge of the day-to-day -day activities, but if I were in charge of VDOT, exactly what Meg said, the first thing tomorrow morning, I would suspend any other work that's in the way and get out there to this site, cut the damn grass, and start cutting the trees back. And Mr. Adams, I can't give you the permission to do that, but the officer come and arrest you if you do it. And you can tell my I said it was okay. If you want to do it, go ahead. I, I know Bob very well. He's out in Wildwater with me. So listen, this has to be done now. No more screwing around. There's no reason we can't send out work crews tomorrow. And if I'm wrong, you know, you tell me, but I'm not. Okay, is the board in agreement that we will close that site until the work is done? I hear any objections whatsoever? Madam County Attorney, do I need a vote on that? Mr. Chairman, I think, uh, I think the message from the board's clear and we can execute that. Right okay, now. the site will be closed immediately? Yes, sir. Until the work is done. 